Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jay from JS Films. In this video, we're going to be talking about substrate path tracing in Unreal Engine 5.3. Now, just a disclaimer, this is a beta version. So uh, whatever you've seen right here might not actually make it to the official release. But honestly, I've been doing this for 5, 5.1, 5.2, and 5.3 now. Uh, so far, everything that I've covered pre-release uh, actually made it to the actual official release. So that being said, I think... What we're going to be doing right now is going to be a huge update. Basically, as you all know, in 5.2, they actually introduced substrate materials, which is going to be the new material system in Unreal Engine 5. But with that being said, I honestly did not think they were going to be able to do it this fast. Pretty much 5.3, it's going to be already implemented. But in 5.2, substrate materials, path tracing is not supported with substrate materials but in 5.3 as you can see right here it is actually now supported so if i go to lit path tracing you can now see that we have a substrate car material right here the opal one and it's rendering in path tracing now this is why i think i don't care what other youtubers say this is why I think Unreal Engine 5.3 is going to be a big deal. They did it so quick. I thought it was going to come out in like 5.5, but it looks like 5.3 is adding a lot of support for substrate path tracing. Now, it's not perfect because right now, whenever I'm trying to add some glass, some mirrors, some windshield to this car, I'm getting crashes. So hopefully by the time they actually officially release 5.3 that they would fix all that issue. I am getting these little black spots still, so you can see, around, but that's totally fine. I'm sure they can figure that out, but this is huge. So my example right here, obviously, is like an overkill. Nobody would want their car looking like this, although it looks kind of cool. But just to see them supporting path tracing with substrate already by just one update that's insane like epic peeps are pretty much working their butts off <laughs> because this is this is incredible man this looks amazing so in 5.2 we tested out hair and eyes and in 5.2 they weren't supported well in 5.3 they are now supported so i'm gonna grab these two over here actually let's grab one at a time all right, let me just kind of maneuver it so you can kind of see it. So we now have an eyeball substrate eye, and we have substrate hair right here, which is a metahuman hair. And again, it now supports path tracing. This looks pretty darn good. And I know my computer is probably crying right now because this um this hair right here is no joke this is this is huge y'all this is this is big look at that that looks so freaking good it's ridiculous all right so with that being said that's pretty much it for this video i think this is why unreal engine 5.3 is going to be a huge huge deal this is the biggest feature i'm pretty sure that's going to be coming out in 5.3